everyone. Welcome back to my channel and welcome back to The Sims 4 Ant Life. So, uh, in between parts, I did give a little small renovation here. Um, not much. I basically, I put in a fireplace and rearranged the furniture so it made a little bit more sense. Um, and added in a TV. So, um, yes, the girls now have a TV. Actually, no, I didn't add in the fireplace. What am I saying? That's been there. The TV is the new thing. Oh my goodness. You'll have to excuse me. Like, um, in case you don't follow me on Twitter, um, I announced last week that I am currently pregnant. So, yay. Um, however, pregnancy brain is real. Like, I have become very, very stupid in a lot of ways. Um, but anyways, I also added in, like, a little bump out here for the front door just because it gave us a little bit more room to walk through down here. Um, okay, so maybe we should wake up Kelly. <laughs> Because you're still asleep and you have to go to school. Uh, so let's see. If you could come down here and grab something to eat. I don't even know what leftovers we have. Um, Olive is pretty good. Like she's a little hungry, but she's not She's not in, in any need of food. Ooh, let's put on this dress. I feel like she never picks out this dress outfit. But it's super cute on her. Um, and then maybe we could just play with the doctor set for a little bit before school. Um, Grace is still sleeping away, but that's okay. She, she kind of needs it. And then Coral, actually Coral could wake up as well. Um, so let's see. Um, so obviously I spent like all of our money doing this. I was thinking I want to, I know at one point I had talked about maybe having a store for Coral's art, but I think we have that new gardening career and I think instead of having her set up a store, I'm going to have her get into the gardening career instead. Um, so that way then we'll have another income. And because it's kind of like a like a work at home thing from what I understand, I've never actually played with it. So I think I think she would be a good candidate for it, though, because she I mean, she obviously gardens quite a bit. Do we have a thermostat in this house? It is very cold. Um, I don't think we do, though. Okay, Grace, so let's have you get up because you have to, well, actually, no, you're, other than needing some sleep, you're kind of in a good spot too. Um, so yeah, so I think I'm going to have her do that. The other thing I want to do is I want to buy a bee box. So we have um, bees outside by our garden. Nope. What are you doing? Please uh -huh. stop eating the meatballs and go to school. Thank you. Um... And actually, I'm going to have you go for a quick jog before I have you start doing your morning routine of taking care of all the plants. Grace, I might just let you sleep up until you actually have to leave for work. Because um, you have everything, everything is done for work. She did get promoted the last time, so she is now a senior manager, which is business level six. So the next time she gets promoted, we'll have to choose either vice president or futures trader. So I don't know which way I want to go on that one. Um, so if you have a suggestion of if she should go towards vice president or being a futures trader, let me know. Um, okay, so both of the girls are off at school. A, good. Everything is checked out here. A, good. Um, what do we have on our schedule? Oh my gosh. I completely forgot. <gasps> it's Olive's birthday. Oh. All right. Huh. Well, I was sort of hoping to build like a roller rink or an ice rink for her. But instead, I think I might just try to find one on the gallery and we can have a party there instead. So hold on a second. I'm going to go look for a rink. Oh, good. She's woken up and gone off to work now. All right. So, oh, and love days tomorrow. Oh my goodness. Okay. So I did find a rink to use for the party. Um, I didn't place it though, because as I was about to, I realized that sometimes when you place a lot, while well, you have Sims who are away at either work or school, um, the game forces them to leave. I don't know. I've had that happen to me before. Um, so I'm not going to risk that because I want everyone to stay at work and school today. Um, so yeah, so, uh, Coral is back from her jog. So naturally after a jog, you should eat meatballs or at least that's what Coral thinks. 
I mean, I don't know. Enjoy Usually after I oh. work out is like, I, I would like water and maybe a smoothie. But nope, she's going straight for that meatball. But you know, no shame. Um, Waffle, what are you all upset about? You have food. It's right over there. I know it's not, it's not the meatball, which I'm sure you would prefer, but tough cookies. Um, okay, so I'm going to have, um, actually, let's cancel this out so then I can tell you to continue eating it. Uh -huh. And eat the meatballs. There we go. And then we can load up the dishwasher and then go to the bathroom. And then we are going to take a shower and let's actually then have you join your career um because obviously we only have 38 simoleons and right now we don't even have the money to throw a birthday party and that's not okay <laughs> so if we could get another source of income that would be good all right so we are going to do the gardener career You've always had a green thumb, which is true, but now you think you can earn some green with it. You'll start by doing a lot of planting and gardening, but keep at it, and you can find success in the science of art in doing so. Oh, wait, in the science or art in doing so. Career branch branches, botanist and floral designer. Well, we'll probably stick with botanist. I mean, we do have some flowers, but okay, so 8 a.m. to 3 p.m., 20 an hour. Not bad. Um, unfortunately, Friday is her normal day off anyways, so... We won't have work until Saturday, but that's okay. So she needs to harvest harvestables. Cool. Uh, yeah, why not? Because um, actually we'll probably need to do that pretty soon anyways. So yeah, actually, yeah, there's already some stuff that's har like ready to be harvested now. We've got some mushrooms and some strawberries. Um, so yeah, that'll be, that'll be good. I think that'll be a nice little boost in income, especially because... I mean, her gardening skill is like, she's almost up to level eight gardening. So, ooh, and at level eight, I just learned this because I just did gardening in my big family little house challenge. Um, but at level eight gardening, the ability to do, what is it called? Super cell or something? Yeah. Uh, super cell, where it actually gives you more money for the items that you harvest. So definitely going to be taking advantage of that. Um... Yes, so after you're done with your shower, let's have you come out here and, okay, so it says we have to, oh, now it says we have to purchase garden seeds. All right. Um, you know, I might get rid of this. Well, actually, no, I'm not going to sell this just yet because we'll probably sell off the uh, kitty game table here and probably the dollhouse as well. So we're, we're going to end up expanding this garden is the point. Um, yeah, I wonder why that just changed. Cause it, I swear it said harvest. I mean, okay, that's cool. So let's purchase seasonal seeds. I wonder, okay. So if we do seasonal seeds, although I might not, um, also that's a lot of money. Okay. Well, we have a couple of days, so let's, let's hold off on that. <laughs> Okay, so let's, um, we're just going to sell all of this. Uh, is there anything that needs to be watered? Or, oh wait, I see water all as an option. Okay, so go, go water, go sell things. Maybe stop reading a book. Just a thought. Good, good. Still holding on to the book. Just in case, because you never know. You never know <laughs> when you might need to uh, read while you garden at the same time. Not read in a garden, mind you, but actually read while you're gardening. Okay, anything else? Oh, now we're up to watering. Still holding on to that book, though. Oh, I don't know that I mentioned this, but um, so obviously the tombstone is gone. I didn't delete it because I wasn't sure if it would like break my game or something, but I also did remove the uh, the dirt marking from where Grace had once been buried. <laughs> Because we don't need that sad reminder of our past anymore. So why not? Oh, I bet she went out front to water the flowers out there. Yeah, that would make, that would make sense. That would almost make too much sense. Water in a way. Very nice. Um, okay, so what else? So 
I guess we could actually purchase seeds now, but I'm thinking maybe instead of buying just seeds that are good for a specific season, um, here, let's go onto the computer. Let's, let's order seeds through this. I mean, we could have done this downstairs, but I wanted to do this through the computer. Okay, so, ooh, farmer flowers and fruit, and then farmer veggies and herbs. Hmm. Uncommon plants. Whoa, that's new. I mean, I don't want to spend 250 simoleons. I'm kind of thinking maybe we should do veggies and herbs. We don't have very many veggies and herbs. Let's do that. All right, so we've purchased our garden seeds. Um, so I guess let's open the seed packet and see what we got. Whoa, we got quite a lot. Um, okay, so we've got basil and carrots and spinach and sage, mushrooms and bell peppers. Ooh, yummy. All right. Well, you know what? I feel bad doing this, but I feel like selling a kid's toys while they're away at school is kind of mean, but we do need the space and like no one else is going to play with this now. So let's move, um, move our fire pit because that's a very realistic thing that we can definitely do. Um, yeah, let's move it over here. And I wonder, okay, so let's see, we can get a couple more of these guys going. All right, so we're, we're back to no money, but we do have Grace who will be coming home and she will be bringing home some money. <laughs> um, Cause yeah, actually we don't even need all of this, but I do definitely want to plant some of these new ones that are, especially the ones that are available for summer. Okay, so yeah, I'm just selling the mushrooms because I don't care. We have a ton of mushrooms. Uh, I think we have spinach, don't we? Yeah, we have spinach. So I'm going to sell the spinach. Do we have carrots? Grape, 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 grape. These are all strawberries. Uh, I think maybe did we have carrots at one point and then they died because we didn't take care of them? I don't remember. We have a lot of spinach. Okay, so let's do... I'm sure this is probably going to end up being a work assignment at some point, but I'm also really afraid that if we don't plant things now, she's going to end up eating them. And I don't want that to happen. So let's plant those three here and then... Let's do bell pepper, bell pepper, and then we can do, hmm, let's do basil, basil, and then, what was this one? Sage? Yes, sage, 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 and then basil. All right, cool. So there's actually still some stuff left. Blair is sending us a, your child. Congrats on landing that sweet job. All right, well. Thank you. That's very sweet, but maybe not totally necessary. What are you all upset about? I see that you're upset about something. All right. So continue, continue planting. Kelly has an A. Olive has an A. Kelly is enraged. So guess what? I'm going to have you not throw a tantrum. You're going to go jogging to clear your mind. And... Sweet little angel baby is going to go clean up the dishes because that's what she does. Of course. All right. Ooh, you need some fun. Um, let's have you take it easy for a little bit at work. I mean, like you're, you're doing real well. You don't, you don't need to work quite so hard. All right. So how is, how is enraged lady going? She actually doesn't really look too enraged when she's running, but she does sort of have that like, I'm so annoyed at everything. I can't believe it. Like that type of a vibe. All right. Yeah, she's definitely, she's definitely got a little, uh, snarl on her face. Um, all right. So yeah, you can just play or whatever. I don't even want you to do your homework because why? <laughs> 
Still planting. All right. Oh, these are already cropping up. Nice. Oh, right, because carrots grow in spring. <laughs> uh, all right. And then let's water all. All right. We're still, still jogging. But at least our enraged mood. Okay, good. It's gone away now. We like being outside. We like the jogging. Things are good. Okay, so let's have you go upstairs, go to the bathroom, and then take a shower. I, well, I mean, if you're going to do your homework, I'm not going to stop you, but y you don't, you don't need to do that anymore. I mean, it's very admirable, but for one thing, you have like outstanding grades anyway, and you're about to not be a child. What are you doing? You're, and you're going to go help her with her homework. Honestly. <sighs> All right. Well, okay then. Um, okay. So who has the higher cooking skill? You have six and you have five. Ooh, that's a close one actually. All right. Good. Uh, oh, Evie Delgado is having a birthday party too. Oh, well, we're going to have a little competition between our two parties. Not, you know, not in, on purpose or anything. Who stayed awake for 24 straight hours? Uh, oh, good. Grace brought home a lot of money. So, Coral, I'm going to have you come down here and you are going to cook the cake because for some reason cakes are not baked, they're cooked. Um, let's see. Do we want to, I think we want to do the blue confetti cake. Yeah, she's in a good mood and she has a high cooking skill, so that should... What are you doing? No, don't go eat meatballs. Here, go watch TV like a normal kid. Uh, yeah, just go watch TV. There we go. All right, then you can come down here and cook a blue confetti cake. All right, Grace. Um, oh, look at you all classed up. You also need to take a shower. So let's have you take a quick shower. Um, and then I'm going to have you go ahead and get started on your reports, even though I don't think you'll get very far before the cake is done. And then we are, you know, you could actually sit and watch TV. There we go. I know it's a little high up. It's a little, it's a little awkward to kind of look up at the screen that high, but mm, that's how it's got to be. Alrighty. Well, you just hit yourself in the head with the bowl, so I'm not holding out high hopes here for this cake. But that's okay. Uh, Alright, so we've got this cake going. Nope, no meatballs for you. Just watch TV with your sister. There we go. Where, where did we get five simoleons from? I wonder, do I have the, um, what is it called? The Penny Pixies trait turned on for this lot? I really do kind of wonder here. All right, so we're going to put birthday candles on this cake. And then I am going to go place that lot and plan the party. And I will see you guys at the party. All right, so we are back. And we are ready for a birthday party. But first, I want to show you this lot that I found. Um, it is actually, I am very impressed with this. So this is uh, the San Myshuno Roller Rink by Granatoisclo. I have no idea if I'm saying that correctly. Um, but yeah, super impressed with this lot. And instead of placing it in San Myshuno, obviously I've placed it here in Windenburg. Um, I got rid of the Hare and Hedgehog Cafe or whatever because I figured this was a little bit different. Um, why are we all getting phone calls? Waffle the cat is calling us because we're about to break curfew. Okay. Well, um, I think maybe the first thing we should do is have... Can we invite to skate everyone? <gasps> yeah, let's all go skating together. And we'll invite Billy to come skate with us too. Because why not? Alright. So, everyone's going to go skating. I'm very excited for this. Actually, I have not um, had my Sims go skating yet which is kind of funny and of course we've got grace rocking the skates in her fancy dress as well 
because, you know, that's just how she is. I mean, no shame. Oh, and birthday girl bites the dust. This is this is actually pretty pretty entertaining. I'm really enjoying watching them try to try to skate without killing themselves. Also, I like how they're all staring at the ground as they do it. All right. Oh. Man, okay. So, birthday girl is really uh really not taking to skating so much, but that's okay. Kelly's not bad though. She hasn't fallen at all. Come on, Olive. You can do it. I believe in you, birthday girl. Look at that determined look on her face. She has like crazy eyes. <laughs> like, I am going to succeed at this no matter what. All right. Um, so I wonder where the rest of our party friends are. I invited a bunch of the kids that she knew. Um, but maybe because it's a bar, they're not going to come. I'm not really sure. Um, but no matter what, we do have to age her up. All right, so, hmm, okay. Well, maybe if we could put the cake over on this table then. And then let's stop skating. Oh, it's night-night. Great. Just what I've always wanted. Um, and then, yeah, let's all stop skating. And then if we could make a wish really hate that this breaks curfew. Yeah, she's like losing responsibility for being at her own birthday party. Even though she's here with her mom and her, her aunt. But no, doesn't matter. Because I don't know why. Alright, so if we could maybe come over here and celebrate. Here, I'm going to pause this real quick. Let's celebrate. And then celebrate. And I know this is breaking your curfew, but guess what? Don't care. Oh my gosh. She's so grown up. Oh, this random man is singing to us. Very nice. Well, okay. I'm sorry. We're all like... Uh... Make a wish. Yeah, responsibility is going way down here. Yay! Happy birthday! All right, are, are we actually going to blow out the candles this time, or? No? Why is this making us do this so many times? There we go! Oh, Olive aged up. Oh boy, okay, so she's out going already. Um, I wish I told you, like, what adults' things they have, like, an advantage of when they aged up. Because now I don't remember what it was. Okay, so I know she obviously has a lot of social. Hmm, I wonder what her other traits should be. I haven't really even thought about those. Urgh, okay. I know her sister's second trait is loves the outdoors. I know we gave her that. Um, hmm... You know what? Let's do perfectionist. I think she will she can be a perfectionist because I think her mom is also a perfectionist. So that would work well for her. Uh, and then... Hmm. I wonder what else... What her aspiration... I mean, like, the aspiration we can always change. That's not as big of a deal. But I'm thinking... I think she might want to uh, see I don't know that she really I think she wants to be successful I don't know that she wants to be wealthy you know what I mean maybe food maybe she wants to like I don't know be like a, a chef of some sort yeah I could see that oh she's so pretty Oh my goodness. Okay, so let's, let's, before I go too much further, let's check out, okay, so her skills are that she has bowling. And that's it. Also, instead of eating a birthday cake, she's eating a sandwich? No, we're not. No. And, of course, selfie time. Perfect! Alright. Please go eat a piece of cake. And eat a piece of cake. 
I'm afraid to see how bad this is impacting their responsibility. But, like, I'm sorry. They're at a birthday party. Like, just because I forgot to change the curfew or take away curfew, this shouldn't impact them. Well, this is quite an interesting uh, assortment of people. Let's see. Can we just throw this in this trash can out here? I really don't want her just eating some random sandwich. All right. So, we now have a house with two teenagers. <laughs> Yikes. Okay. Um, are you kidding on us? She is. She's flirty. Okay, Lily. Please. You are flirting with a teenager. That is not acceptable. Olive is like... Look at this glam necklace she has on, too. Like... Oh, there's a knight glitching through the wall. Cool. Cool, cool. Alright, so she's aged up. We've done some skating. Um, apparently she wants to also go dancing. I think I might actually go ahead and end the party a little early because it's like 10 o'clock at night and they have school in the morning. Um, so I don't know if I'm going to end up doing a little like mini speed makeover of Olive or not. Um, oh, okay. Uh, I really want to be friends with someone, but they don't want to be friends with me. Okay. Just keep being friendly. Just be nice to them. It's cool. Um, but anyway, so thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you've enjoyed it. Um, if you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, you can do so down below. I put out a new video every single day, Monday through Friday. So thank you so much for watching, and I will see you all in my next video. Bye!